you know, a 50s diner, you see that nostalgia of the community coming together. Anybody's welcome and everybody's welcome and no one feels out of place. That's what makes the diners special. My dad uh, founded the company. Me and my brother owned the company. Dad was the uh, mind behind it. It's just our job not to screw it up. I'm on my way home. Dad told me and my brother, because we were having to work for free, because there was only one store, my brother said, well, Dad, how do we get paid? And he goes, well, when pigs fly. So we went and got a pig and put it on a string. After a while, we opened a few more restaurants, and we finally started getting a check here and there. This business is based on customer service. It's based on relationships. That's what we do every day in every restaurant. We can be that community diner because of the partners we have. Heartland has partnered with us and we've partnered with them so we feel like we're in this together. Before Heartland, we, we were old school. We still had handwritten gift cards. It legitimately was a 10 key cash register that we input all the pricing in. While it worked for us, it didn't give us any information on what items we were selling by location. We were missing add-on sales. Um, we were ringing up wrong pricing. We never knew what our liabilities were. And after partnering with Heartland and looking at the analytics, I can see everything in one place. Our sales, our credit cards, our gift cards, all of our payments. It kind of surprised us how many return customers we have, which has helped us in our growth. So it's one less thing I have to worry on, is our growth slowed because of our partners? I don't have to worry about that with Heartland. We're listening to restaurant people because we're running restaurants. It just makes me feel like, oh yeah, they know our brand. They know who we are. They know what we stand for. And that's a good feeling. Mm -hmm.